Hello and welcome people to a little quick brief um, just been thinking very much recently as always right just gonna put on some background music here because yeah I don't want if it's easy to hear through the room, so I don't want people to hear me, you know. Self-conscious, I guess. But whatever. Yeah, where do I even start with this video? Just been thinking very much about how important it is to uh, sacrifice and commit to just take a risk to go for what you have in mind what you have in your intuition what feels important what do you actually visualize what is in your dreams what is um, what do you feel that keeps you going you know what makes you feel inspired what makes you feel alive what makes you feel curious those things and I it's funny where I'm living now it's like sometimes I'm thinking do I am I finished here and then I can be like um, other days it's just amazing it's just great and, and it is in a lot of ways it is i'm just it's great uh, some days i think it's like so great to be have the opportunity to live here and the location uh, but then you think one step ahead again like is all of this aside all of these good things you know but is that really me because thinking what do i actually have here not too much to be honest um no i don't really have i don't really have friends to be honest and living situation here where i'm living now I don't think I'm gonna go into details about it, but ever since I lived here, it's been like a roller coaster. Just really want my own place. I I, I could get my own place if I want. I know how I can do it, but it's the, I just very focused on my fin financial goals, so it's more lucrative and makes more sense to stay here because of that. But. Yeah, for sure, I gotta make some, I have to make some decisions, some like real serious decisions. I just want something to go over to you. I want something to transfer to, you know, and again, maybe I am finished here. I mean, I don't know. I guess I can't say now, but Considering the situation now also about the damn shit going on, you know, with the, the virus. Personally, not too concerned about it. I know it's serious and everything, but um, considering that, I think it's not a good idea to just call it out, call that it, you know, call it it and then just stop working, you know. Uh, but I have my plan also I really do have my plan I have my like my passion my dream and my what should I call it what things that I would like to accomplish and do and that feels nice that feels like obviously gotta do that but then <laughs> speaking of the video that I made the other other day about 
a multipotentialist. Wow. Just think about it how I don't know why I am this way. It's like I have this channel, okay? I'm thinking I would like to like make another um what should you say? I said that so many times before, but I would like to make um, like another channel, I guess. And I've been thinking about so many different channels, like everything from political, social, commentary, uh, indie documentary videos, um, yeah, a bunch of other stuff that I can't really remember now. But you know, the thing is that I just discovered a video now, the, like today, I guess channel and it's just this basic channel very similar to mine to be honest just bunch more subscribers but that's not the essential thing but it's interesting it's sort of the same style this guy just kind of documenting his life it's a bit more outgoing i guess in uh, using uh, making footage outside of the home I mean, I do as well, I, I did a lot, but it's mostly focused like this, interaction with you, like this. And that's fine too, but it's interesting. I just, the, I don't want, I wouldn't want to have like a, what should I take for example? You know, I wouldn't want to make a weird, like this mainstream channel that is, trying to attract so much people. I don't like that. I like to make some kind of smaller, which includes a lot of different things like this. It includes uh, INFP personality. It includes uh, like, I guess, philosophical uh, aspects, conversations, uh, spirituality. But then also about current events, um, personal, like about me, but also not really about me. <laughs> Strange combination, right? <laughs> um, that's me, I guess. And the, speaking of that, that, that guy, uh, when I saw that channel, I just immediately like saw myself doing something similar but actually my channel like I said it is similar already but I I don't know what that is with me but I can like see myself in so many people and I can see myself in so many situations and people um, I guess that's a strength but it can also be kind of annoying because it's like I dive into something that seems very interesting I go very deep into it and not very deep into it, but I really get absorbed by it. And I feel I can watch, just watch that channel, for example, all the time. Or if it's in a business idea or whatever, I research so much about it and then I just fall out of it. Because I guess, I, I think it's uh, external, extroverted intuition that you see the outside world and you match your values to things that comes up in your life that seems interesting and so so on so on and so forth um, I've been thinking about making a review channel reviewing things not not really things obvious but like reviewing food but no I'm not really too interested in that. It's just because I saw also there the same example. I just saw this um, other channel guy reviewing food and it's just very like nice personality and uh, popped up very big this channel. And then right away I just tried to match my values like, oh, is that something I could do? Extrovert intuition, it's a mess. But I know what I want to do. I know I want to include, 
I would love to help some way in like coaching or counseling uh, together with I have my writing, I have my creative outlet, I have the part of uh, menu structure or uh, briefing ideas to build up business um, as a as a strat strategist or include marketing there um, and then my music of course you know it's just so many things that I want to do but again it cannot happen just right away yeah it's anyway it's just uh, nice to brief and let my thoughts out a little bit this Monday Monday evening and we gotta stay positive it's the only way be positive and move forward and not be afraid to fail just shoot for something and try it out like there are many stars you can hit you know if you hit the wrong one at least you hit the sky and then there are many other st stars that you go for yeah sort of a quote that i took that i heard recently from someone anyway i think i'm gonna continue writing some guitar parts i think and talk to you soon okay over and out bye